Hello there, this is D, and welcome to Uneven. I thought I'd take a few minutes this morning just to step back and relax for a bit. This past week for me was a little chaotic. We had a slight shower fix in our shower a couple weeks ago that kept growing and growing and <laughs> growing continuing to find water damage and all that kind of stuff and currently our shower in our master bedroom is completely gutted and that means that we have to get find people workers that will come in and work and help us with it and have to go tile shopping and have to redo probably two-thirds of the tile in our shower and this is a big shower and all kinds of work and I'm not trying to get into that right now but with all that going on and with work happening and with both of us working from home and my dog and other dogs coming over and everything, I had difficulty finding quiet time to record a podcast for you, to say hi and to get my work done. And the stress of that, the noise of the construction and the jackhammers and buzz and saws and tile saws and everything and and all the stuff going on just kept building and building. And so this was minor, again, in the realm of stressors in many people's life. This is minor. But it still builds. And you start to get this tension, this underlying stress in your life. And that's what happened to me again. Much as it happened on the road trip. But that was definitely more significant for me. Again, not in the realm of world problems, but for me. This one's a minor, but it I don't notice the stress building sometimes. Until there it is, and you get a little more short with people. A little more irritable. Little things set you off. You never fully relax, because you're waiting for the next shoe to drop. And that's the state I was in. Yesterday morning we had about six inches of snow. And I got out to walk the dog in the snow and it was just beautiful coming down. and So quiet and so peaceful. And that's when I notice the difference from the chaos and noise and everything in the house and the peace that was outside. This morning the snow has ended and the sun came out and the snow is just glistening. I'm actually staring at it right now. In fact, I'm staring at it from my car sitting near a construction zone. <laughs> may not be idyllic, but it actually works. This was the only place I could find that was peaceful and quiet. It's about 14 degrees outside, so I going outside wasn't something I wanted to do to record this. It's difficult to record when I'm walking the dog because I'm always trying to teach him and train him. And so I finally got in the car and headed to get my chai at the grocery store that I do in the mornings, and I decided to pull off and say hello. And just marvel at the beauty of a fresh snowfall. With the sun coming out today, it's just gorgeous. And I thought this would be a good chance for us to take a second. To just relax. Pull ourselves out of the moment we're in. And enjoy the nature, the world, the beauty that surround us. And I don't care where you are, I guarantee you there's beauty around you. Maybe it's snow-covered tree limbs just glistening and hanging and drooping down in pines and the, and the weeds bending over in the snow. Or maybe it's a park nearby. Maybe it's a trail you're on. Maybe it's a, the sunrise over the the dunes of a cave. Maybe it's 
just a candle flickering in a room. It always surrounds us. It's always there. We just have to take a moment to look. And that's what I'm doing this morning. It's so quiet and so peaceful here. I tried to find about five different places this morning at home to record, but there was always noises and chaos and something happened, so I have to step out. And my wife and I don't have children, so I can't even imagine what some of your homes are like with the chaos of three, four, five, eight people living in the same house. But sometimes we need to step away and just relax, take a few deep breaths, and just admire the beauty that surrounds us. It is so beautiful. Many of you may have don't experience snow very often. And many of you are okay with that. <laughs> I wouldn't be. I'm a man of four seasons. I like all of them. Winter is one of my favorites. I think the quiet, the peacefulness, the beauty, maybe it's something a more chaotic soul like myself who ruminates and has looping thoughts and anxieties and ADHD and all that kind of stuff. Maybe that's something I crave. But I find snow very peaceful. And I enjoy it so. So I thought I would talk with you today in just a more mellow tone. And maybe this is something you can listen to and just relax. Maybe you're in a place where you can close your eyes and even just meditate to the sound of my voice or just join me on this exploration of the beauty around us. Sometimes it just takes those 5, 10, 15 minutes of your day to reset yourself. To recenter yourself. To find a new mindset for the challenges of the coming day. Sometimes that's all it takes. Sometimes that's all it takes to improve our lives. Just a few minutes each day. And breathing can be essential with that too. As we're relaxing here, just slow your breathing a little bit and deepen it as you do. And notice it. Notice the rhythm of your breath. Notice the automatic nature of it. Notice how the stress slips out of your body with each exhale. In such a busy, chaotic, hyper-paced world, we have less and less moments like this. But in the Uneven Podcast, we're going to provide some more of them. Some just relaxation moments. Maybe even a few meditations along the way. It never hurts just to listen for a little bit to somebody saying, Hey, Take a step back. Take a deep breath. 
and then look at the look at the day ahead of you again from fresh relaxed eyes and mindset and breathing release some of the tension in your shoulders release some of the tension in your legs in your abdomen in your pelvis in your ankles it's amazing when you scan your body where you find those hot spots those parts of your body where you've been clinging to and holding on to stressors take a few minutes and go through check your body and find those spots of tension and and release them I'm doing that right now as I'm talking to you and staring out at the snowfield. And I already feel better. I'll keep this one short. It's just a quick relaxation moment. But I thank you for joining me. And I wish you the best for the day and hope you can cling to just a little bit of this mindset as you go through the day. Take care and I'll talk to you soon. Hey, this is Dee. Thank you so much for stopping by and checking out our podcast. I do need to remind everyone that this podcast is for informational purposes only and should never be considered medical, psychological, or professional health advice of any kind. If you or someone you know is dealing with significant mental health issues, please seek professional help. Resources can be found in our show notes and on our website at unevenpodcast.com. Take care of yourself, and I'll catch you on the flip side.